Back in June, 16-year-old Junior Guzman ran into Yayi's Deli and Grocery in the Bronx, trying to hide behind the counter as a group of men came after him. But the gang dragged him out and stabbed him to death. Today, that corner bodega is a safe haven, the first in the city to implement the Safe Bodega program. We know that if the bodega owner could lock the door and prevent people from entering, at least it would give him enough time to contact the local authorities. The Safe Bodega program is the NYPD's six-step safety program to prevent gang assaults and robberies. One is a panic button that workers can press in an emergency situation. It triggers step two, magnetic locks on the doors that can prevent someone from opening the door to leave or come in. Law enforcement can monitor the camera system that's installed both inside and outside the store. Four, police can quickly identify the threat and respond. Number five, the panic button sets off a flashing blue light and bright floodlights outside, making it easy for patrolling officers to spot an emergency. And number six, laminated windows and shatterproof glass on the doors that prevent unwanted threats from entering. I feel that uh, this is going to be, uh, uh, we're going to feel more secure. We're saving our employees and our community too. The program was implemented after the United Bodegas of America met with police asking for recommendations during a safety summit last month. The group is encouraging all 20,000 bodegas in the city to install these safety measures. <laughs> Now, this six-step security system will cost about $4,000. Each bodega owner will have to pay for that on their own. But the owner of this bodega behind me tells us that he has been struggling financially since Junior Guzman's murder. So the owner of the security company that installed the system decided to foot the bill. We're live in the Belmont section of the Bronx. Hazel Sanchez, CBS 2 News.